a longtime Tama business is closing. Tama Paperboard has been open for more than 100 years. And the closure has bigger consequences than just business. People will lose their jobs once that paper mill closes. And as KCCI's Kayla James shows us, the local lake and the trails could suffer too. People in Tama tell us the paper mill here and Cherry Lake go hand in hand. Recreational fun comes with the lake and jobs, of course, come with the mill. So, of course, people are worried about the mill's closure and the domino effect it could have. When it comes to Tama's more than century old paper mill. I have friends who work there. My dad worked there many years ago. It's hard to find a person in town who doesn't know someone who works or did work there. Yes. So for people in Tama County, like James Shevchik, Tama Paperboard's closure is a rough hit to take. Mill's always been here. Graphic Packing International is the mill's parent company after buying it earlier this year. A spokesperson tells KCCI the company announced its decision to close the mill on Tuesday and expects the closure to be complete by next month. Iowa Workforce Development's website shows 85 people would be laid off. We're told employees knew a closure was coming after the mill was bought, but didn't expect it to be this soon. And with its closure comes another concern. What's going to happen with this when it does shut down? Cherry Lake, right next to the mill, could dry up. It's kind of like a like a staple. A staple where people can fish with loved ones and walk the trail around the water. That's not too deep. It was about waist deep, but you sank about knee deep into silt, which is kind of going to be an issue. The city says the mill plays a role in keeping the lake's water high. Tama's mayor tells KCCI a well fills the paper mill, which uses both city water and well water. Some of the mill's water goes into the lake helping keep it full. Some people are worried, but Shevchik is hopeful people's love for the area will provide a solution. We still have some pride left and there's, there's enough people and I think enough resources, hopefully that we can keep this going. In Tama, Kayla James, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.